Hi, my name is Pesha Grover and I'm here today with Isha Patabi and Angela Kamruka from Troy High School. They are here to talk about how they started their own club at Troy High School through which students had more tutoring opportunities for Detroit kids. So we're going to go on with a couple questions. So the first one is, um, what made you want to start a DES tutoring club at your school? So when I found out we would be tutoring inner city kids, I kind of jumped to the idea. I thought it was really interesting, um, like tutoring underprivileged kids, because most students at um, Troy High that start clubs, or most students at other schools don't like start clubs that help back to society. So, um, and it's a really good opportunity for Troy High kids to get volunteer hours as well. Angela, approximately how many tutors do you have in the club right now, and do you think this is a good number? We have approximately 46 to 47 tutors right now in the club. I think this is a good number considering that this is our first year starting the club up at the school. We've had many last minute dropouts and cancellations, so having a large amount of tutors leaves room for backup tutors last minute. So how would you describe the process of starting this club at Troy High? So um, I would say it was not very easy considering Troy High School was one of the first schools to start Detroit Education Society. Um, we had to approach several administrators just to find like the right go-to person. Um, we had we had to like we were like exchanging fifty plus emails to administrators trying to convince them why our club is different than others. So how would you describe it? Um, we got rejected by counselors, vice principals, and principals, but we still didn't give up after that. After this, we created a PowerPoint presentation and we presented it to the key folks. And then after this, they, I guess they got the idea that it was a beneficial club and why we should start it up at our school. It was a very vigorous process. And Isha. As a leading board member your first year, what challenges have you faced and how have you overcome them? So we faced a couple challenges this year. Um, the main challenge we had was last minute dropouts from our tutors. This was a difficulty because people, like um, tutors from Troy High would just drop out on the day of and it was hard to get backup tutors imme immediately. And um, another problem we had was we didn't have very committed board members so they weren't really, um, so it was hard to like um, communicate and communicate with the tutors that we have at Troy High. And we overcame these challenges by getting hiring new board members who are very efficient with the club. And yeah. Okay, thank you so much for coming here and telling us about your experiences. This video was brought to you by Detroit Education Society. DES tutors kids in Detroit through all STEM categories. And if you want to join our cause, please check our website, www.detroiteducation.org. <laughs>